everyone. Happy Saturday. So I'm doing this live. It's a live of, um, of my actual uh, reactions to Tabitha Brown's new items that she has, to her new items that she has in Target. Um, I finally was able to get my hands on some. The first time I ordered some, um, it looked as if the order went through and then I got an email from Target saying we had to cancel the items because they are no longer in stock. So I did that twice and then on, was it, I'm going to say Friday morning, something told when I got up for work, I got up pretty early, um, maybe around 5.30 or so, and something said, go ahead and get that order in early um, and see what happens. And so I went ahead and I ordered my items and lo and behold, they were not canceled. Um, and so when I went to pick my items up from Target, hey everyone, I see everyone waving. When I went to pick my items up from Target, um, I did go back there to look at Tabitha Brown's display to see what item, what other items they did have in stock. Um, it was very scarce. The food items are going very fast. So I'm going to do a taste test of the items that I got, and I'll give you all my honest opinion on it. So I got um, a bag of the popcorn. It's the vegan uh, roasted garlic and... Uh, Parmesan. I got the dill popcorn. That's the one that I could not wait to get my hands on and that's the one that was canceled twice. Um, then I got the sweet and salty popcorn. I also got her vegan black and garlic um, dry roasted mixed nuts. So I'll try those with you all. And I got, and I think this is going to be really good, I got the vegan cherry and granola. I think that's going to be really good because I love granola and I love dried fruit. So I think that's going to be really good. I have some crackers here. The crackers are not Tabitha Brown's uh, brand. I just got it to try with the spread. Um, I got the vegan lemon and dill garlic spread. And I got the caramelized onion cream cheese spread. So those are all of the things that I'm going to try with you all. I'm going to start with the spreads first because I've had them in the refrigerator um, and I do want to try them while they are cold. Um, so just looking at the, I love cheese, um, but I've recently been told that I do have to watch my cholesterol and I was told by my nutritionist that a vegan option is, is um, maybe the way to go for me, a low fat cheese or a vegan option. So I'm excited about this because I love cheese and I especially love cream cheese. So this item here, it, um, it doesn't have any cholesterol, so that's really good. It only has 90 calories and it only has eight grams of fat. Um, so for those who are watching the fat, um, the sodium is 160, so that's not too bad. Um, so I can't wait to, I'll go ahead and I'll try this first again because it's cold and um, it's been refrigerated and I do want to try it while, while it's cold. And again, this is the cream cheese and the flavor of it, it's a vegan cream cheese, and the flavor of it is caramelized onion. It smells like your regular uh, Philadelphia cream cheese, you know, the onion and chive ones that we normally buy. That's what it's, it smells like, cream, regular cream cheese. So the type of crackers that I bought to try this with, and again, this is a Tabitha uh, Brown's brand, but it's an everything bagel um, cracker. So I think that's going to be pretty good. So let's try it and see how it tastes. Go ahead and rip it open. Go ahead and get my little spread so I can spread it on there. Crackers kind of broke, but that's okay. Now, one thing, okay, so I do notice little chips of, I don't know, little pieces of the caramelized onion in there. I don't know if you all can see it. Um, that's what I was looking for. It does, it smells just like cream cheese and onion. I think it's going to be good. Oops, my cracker broke, but that's okay. So I have it on there. It 
really good. It is very good. Um, it tastes like, it does taste like cream cheese, but I think it has a little more, um, the taste is a little more smoother than regular, a little more smooth, rather, than regular cream cheese. You know, regular cream cheese has somewhat of a, I don't know, pungent, I can't explain it, but this is, it tastes like cream cheese, but it's a little more smooth, a little more milder than cream cheese. That's the best way I can explain it, but it's very, very good. The onion flavor is there. It's good. So, that's a winner. It would be really good on a bagel, too. That's definitely a winner. So, the next one that I'm going to try, I'm going to move this over to the side. I'm going to try, now this is called, um, it's a garlic spread, and it says it is perfect for adding to sandwiches, uh, bowls, or roasted vegetables. So I'm just going to try it with um, with the crackers and see how it tastes. Um, it has 90 calories as well. Now this has zero carbs. For those of you who may be watching your carbs, it has zero carbs, so that's, that's good. Um, total fat is 9 grams. Saturated fat is 0 0.5, so that's not bad at all. Sodium is only 100 milligrams. That's really not bad at all. Um, but I don't see the protein count on this one. Not protein, I'm sorry. I don't see the cholesterol the cholesterol count on this one. Um, but that's okay. Because this is, this is how it looks. It, it kind of smells mayonnaise to me, so I don't know how I'm going to like it on the crackers. But we'll see. We'll see. I'm gonna clean my clean my palette from the other one. Since it tastes kind of mayonnaise-y, I'm not gonna get a whole bunch of it. It even has the look of mayonnaise. So we'll see. Mm. It's good, but it's definitely a sandwich spread. It's very good. I can taste the dill in there. Can taste the garlic. I mean, it's good, but again, it's definitely a sandwich spread. I wish I would have gotten some type of little, little type of bread and made some type of little sandwich, but that's okay. It's good though. Mm hmm. Very good. Mm. And again, this one is the. I'm going to talk with my mouth full. It's a garlic spread and it's lemon dill. So it's really good. So. Next, I'm going to try the, I'm going to try the, because um, I've heard a lot about these, I'm going to try the mixed nuts. I mean, the flavor of the nuts, the mixed nuts is black garlic. Let me drink some water while I get it open. Put it get them open. They don't smell real garlicky. I should have. I noticed that. Um, see, it looks like there's a lot of seasoning down there. So I'm going to shake it up a little bit. Yeah. Doesn't smell real garlicky even after I shook it up. black garlic so I've never had black garlic before it's different um it doesn't taste garlicky to me and I don't know if it's because it's black garlic 
But they're, they're seasoned very well. I can't explain the seasoning. And again, I've never had black garlic. They're good. Um, they have total fat is 13 grams. Saturated fat is 1.5 grams. That's not bad. Total carbs is 7. That's not bad. And 2 grams of fiber, which is pretty decent. Um, trans fat is 0. That's really good. Cholesterol is 0. Again, that's good for me because I was recently advised that I do need to watch my cholesterol. So, 0 grams of cholesterol. So, they it's going to be a really good um, snack food. So, that's good. Um, calories is 160 and the serving size is 1 ounce. About 32 pieces. They're good. Um, okay. So, next we, we have... We're down to drum roll, please. My favorites, the popcorn. So I'm gonna start from what I feel like I would like. Um, I'm gonna do well. I feel like I would like them all, but I'm gonna save the best for last, which is the deal. So I'm gonna start with um, the sweet and salty since I just had the nuts. Let's just start with something sweet. I'm sorry, you guys. No, that's not. We're not down to the popcorn. We have to try the trail mix. And this is vegan cherry and granola trail mix. Um, 12 grams of fat, which is not bad. The serving size is one fourth cup. That, that's a pretty a good size. Uh, cholesterol is zero. Sodium is 85 milligrams. Uh, that's not bad. Um, carbs is 15 with three grams of fiber. Total sugar is only seven. That's not bad at all. Okay, so let's see what the vegan cherry granola is about. It's giving us. This is how it looks. Looks really good. Smells really good. I'm just gonna get try to get a handful of everything. The cherries, the nuts, and the granola. That's what I'm going to try to do. I see all different types of nuts in there. Um, so I see I got a handful. I don't know if I'm going to eat all that. Mm -hmm. This is good. Really good. It's um it's sweet, tangy, and a little bit salty. The um and for those of you that are just joining, I'm trying Tabitha Brown's foods from Target. I've already tried her vegan cream cheese, one of her sandwich spreads. Um I've tried her black garlic mixed nuts. And now we are trying the cherry and granola trail mix. It's um it's a little salty, not just a little tangy bit of salt, sweetness, and that tangy all mixed in one. It's good. And then you have your granola. Um, something is also bringing a little cinnamon taste. It's good. It's good. So so far. I like everything. Now drum roll and we're down to the popcorn. Let me clean my palate. So, the first popcorn I am going to try is, <coughs> pardon me, <coughs> the vegan sweet and salty <coughs> organic popcorn. And I believe all of her items are organic. Well, maybe not. But the popcorn is organic. Um, so I'm going to try that first. The sweet and salty popcorn. And this is by Tabitha Brown. For those of you who just joined. And thank you so much for joining my live. Mmm. 
This is good. It has a really good buttery taste to it. I don't know if it's supposed to, but it does to me. It's really good. I think it has a little more sweetness to it than it does salt, salty. Now, you can taste the salty, but to me, it has a little more of a sweet taste than it does salty. But again, you can taste it, taste them both. But it's very good, very, very. It's very good. Let me put it down so I don't eat the whole bag. Okay, so now we have the vegan roasted garlic and parmesan organic popcorn. So I um, watched a video of Kay. I've eaten some of this one. So this one I think is one of her favorites. So let's try it. The one in the purple bag. Oh, this one is really good, too. Mmm. I'm getting a little piggy. This is good. You can definitely taste the Parmesan cheese. Um, definitely taste the garlic. It's very good. And I didn't give you the, in, the nutritional values on that one. I will in a minute. It has a, this one has 120 calories. 5 grams of fat, that's really good. 0 grams of trans fat and saturated fat, 0. That's very good. Cholesterol, 0. So that's good. Uh, sodium is 180. Mm, that's not horrible. Um, carbs is 15 and fiber is 4. So that's not bad. This is really good. This is good. Very flavorful. So the um, first bag of popcorn that I had, 120 calories, 6 grams of fat, 0 trans, 0 saturated, um, cholesterol 0, sodium 190, carbs 16, and fiber 4. So now we're down to the last one, the dill popcorn, which I, if I was, was to bet, I would say out of all of the popcorns, the dill would be my favorite, but that Parmesan and garlic is very good. And so is the uh, salty and sweet. Okay, so here's the dill popcorn. 120 calories, um, six grams of fat, zero trans, zero saturated, which is really good, zero grams of cholesterol, which is really good. Sodium is 230, so it's higher than the other two. Uh, carbs 16, dietary fiber is 4, so it's not bad. And the serving size for each one is uh, 3 cups. So let's see. Let's put in my palette. Uh, good the deal is definitely there it's very good <clears throat> it's really good um it has that tangy deal flavor but to me it also has just a little bit of an earthy deal flavor as well let me pull my shirt up my tie is coming undone um really good Feel some. This is very, very good. So between the parmesan, when it comes to um, snacks like popcorn, um, I'm more of a, I guess, I don't know, salty type, you know. But so, the, like I said, the sweet and salty is good. But this deal and the um, roasted garlic and parmesan, I don't know which one is my favorite. I can't, I can't choose. They are both really good. They are very, very flavorful. Um, so that's it. We've tried all of um, Tab's stuff. Again, the uh, pickings were kind of uh, slim when I went into the store when they have her display. I was able to order some things from Target, thankfully, and I was able to go pick them up. 
So again, today I have tried the vegan cherry and granola trail mix, which is really, really good. I think it would be a nice, healthy little snack. Um, if we're trying to watch, you know, certain things like cholesterol and things of that nature. I also think this would be good on a salad. Um, for those of us who sometimes watch our carbs, um, this would be good on a salad. Uh, um, then I also tried the black garlic dry roasted mixed nuts. Um, these were good. Um, they were a little, these to me have a really, that's a really, really earthy taste to them. And again, I've never tried black garlic before, so I don't know uh, I, what it tastes like. I didn't know what to expect. Um, but it had this has a really, really earthy taste to it. it it's good. An again, it'll be an another, you know, handful, nice little snack. I tried the garlic spread, and I got the lemon dill. I think this would be really good on a sandwich. It's, it's the, almost, to me, it's the texture of mayonnaise really uh it's vegan though um and it's really smooth taste and i think it, i i tried it with crackers um just because but i think it would be really good on a sandwich um and then i tried the cream cheese this this was one of my favorites tonight the vegan cream cheese it's really really smooth um it's caramelized onion cream cheese it's really good. It'll be good on bagels. It was good with the crackers that I had it on. This was really good. And of course, we tried our popcorns. We had our sweet and salty pink bag. This is buttery. To me, it's a little more sweet than salty, but it's still very, very good. Um, then we tried our dill popcorn. This is really good. I will probably... Or can I tell a story? When I when I watch um whatever shows I'm gonna watch tonight, this one is gonna be on deck. Or this one. Or maybe both of them. I don't know. This one is your vegan roasted garlic and parmesan organic popcorn. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'll mix them together and have a little bit of both of them on deck. Let me try, let me see. If I mix them together. My shirt. That's good. So that's it. Those are all of the items that I was able to get my hands on um, um, with regards to Tabitha Brown's new items in Target, her grocery items. Um, everything was delicious to me. I am wanting to... Um, cut back on my meat intake um, so it seems like Tabitha is giving us some really good vegan options um, you know things that, that we will actually like um, everything was delicious so let me know have you all tried anything and let let me know in the comments what you all have tried um, what you thought about it um, and until next time I will see you again. Again, I want to thank you so much for joining my live. Um, if you like and share this video, I greatly appreciate it. I am my sister's mirror. And if you don't mind, also swing on over to YouTube and join my YouTube channel as well. Thank you so much.